What do we have? We have chicken in the pot, man. City boy going country. We at it. I can't believe I'm doing this. Got me a chicken today. I watched a YouTube video on how to harvest the meat. I'm going to attempt to do it. Let's see if I do good or bad. First thing I've seen everyone do is dump that hot water. We got these feathers off. Of course, my pot's not big enough. We're going to do half one side. Half the other. So basically you're doing this to soften the feathers up because you gotta pluck them. Once we pluck them, I found out how to carve the cavity to get the organs out to not contaminate the meat. I just saw a video not too long ago. You get that? Oh! Ah! Ah! Burning my hurt! Woo! One hot bird, one hot bird, one hot bird. I got something to put my feathers in. Let's attempt this. Look at that. Right off. Good video I watched. And we are plucking. We are plucking a chicken. So you know, a farm is tough. But do you know what's tougher than the farm? farmer. I plan on getting a farm one day. I want my own farm, so I'm practicing. As you can see, I eat what I kill. No GMO, no hormones, just natural, which I'm excited. I taste the difference in the hog. Wild hogs are going to the store and getting that meat. This little bugger was out in a wildlife management area. I couldn't believe it. No python got it, no coyote, no fox, no bobcat. Was a survivor until a human came along. But you know, my grocery store looks different. Just don't judge me for that. This is a lot of work. I'm gonna fast forward here now because I don't think you want to see this anymore. It just takes way too long. Cheaper going to the store, paying five bucks. Walmart got it, chicken ready to go. Country boy. Starting to look like a chicken that you buy at the grocery store. This is the process. This is dinner tonight. I don't know how I'll make it, but I'll definitely do another episode tonight to show you how we cook it. I'm not playing yet. We are out here trying to live off the land. There was a food crisis and you gotta go survive for your food. How many of you can actually do it? I'm learning, I'm not gonna find out. Is there anyone that would love to have me as an intern on a ranch? I would love to go out there. I learned, so I definitely wanna know the ins and outs. I did. I plan on having a ranch. I want my own livestock. You know, I know it's a tough job, but waking up every day, knowing where your food comes, how it's raised, it's pricey. It's a lot of work, as you can see. Turkey? Chicken. Chicken? You shot it? Yeah. I do my own hunting. I do. What you hunting? Everywhere. I do uh, iguanas, hogs, deer. What? <laughs> what is it like? A chicken, believe it or not. Really? When you get a chance, go to YouTube and look up iguana lifestyle. And you'll see a little bit of my stuff. Oh, oh that's amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Iguana lifestyle. All right. Take it easy, boss. Keep in mind, I'm doing this in a residential community. 
in my backyard. I can only imagine the people's thought process watching me do this. Be shot. Oh, oh, it's warm. Oh, it's warm. Judge how I did for a person that's never done this before. Let me know. My first chicken, man. I'm excited. I'm proud of myself. But let me know. Any tips, any more tricks, something I did wrong. Let me know. I like criticism, good or bad. It makes me better. I know first thing right now what people are going to be mad at, but I didn't use the heart in the liver. I know you guys use everything. I'm not there yet. I'm just not ready. But I will get there. I like to be with professionals. But hey, I got my chicken ready to go. I'm gonna finish cleaning her out in the sink. Water vinegar. Stay tuned for me cooking her up, baby. Hope you enjoyed. It was a good experience for me. I enjoyed. Peace.